Now, this is week two of Ernie, a truck driver from Washington State. Came up with his mother with plantar fasciitis. He has low back pain, sciatica, neck pain, carpal tunnel, heart palpitations, and can't go poops all the time. We saw his problem on his x-rays as a high neck reversal. Treatment always wasn't just exactly straightforward. A little dizzy here, you can see it. Uh, we took lots of notes, learned a lot, continued to adjust them, and I think we got somewhere. Oh. Six weeks later, he came back, threw his back out working. And that's in the story, too. Check it out. Tell us, Ernie, what went on this weekend. Uh, I felt good walking around, ice again, and walk around, do everything, you know, gradually. And always be aware of your posture, how you walk. Good. And then this morning, I woke up, and I'm like, oh, pain again. Then I try to correct what I'm doing wrong. It didn't go away, so I came here in the office now, and then I showed Dr. Thayer what I do, and he said, like, no, you gotta correct the posture like this. I did that and walk a little bit, and it's amazing that it just, the pain would just really go down if you do it right. <laughs> He's on the right path. The reason why is becoming aware and becoming aware of the pain and becoming aware of what you're doing right and wrong is very important. And this is one week down, one week to go. By the end of the week, he'll be doing a lot better with this. But again, he's learned in the right sequence. He's doing pretty good right now. Monday morning is Atlas Day. On your back, sir. See, I come right out here. I'm coming right off the back of your bone right here. And this is the Atlas right here. It's just a different location. Same adjustment we gave you before. Well, he is nervous now. Oh. Good. Oh. <sighs> what does that feel like, sir? Oh, my world uh, turned. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. That's what she said again. So, anyways, what else? Oh. Do you like that nice and oh. deep? It's nice and deep, yeah. Oh. 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 It's really strong. Oh. oh, I think I feel something on my left arm. <laughs> ah. Of course you did. Wow. Hold on, down to your toes too? <laughs> how dizzy are you, dude? Really? Yeah. Hey, turn around and tell them how dizzy you are. What, what do you feel? I'm just kind of curious. Still dizzy. Yeah, yeah th this adjustment is really different compared yeah. to the previous one. Yeah. So Ernie, tell us how last night was. Tell us how yesterday was after that adjustment and the posture change. So I feel a big, big change. I know there's a big change in my posture. I'm not walking like I used to be before. And when I do the posture that you told me to do, I don't feel any pain. And when I try to go back to the old ways, then the pain, you know, it comes back. Right yeah. There. And so he had the revelation this morning. Look at these notes, guys. So not every note is perfect. On and not every note is uh, everybody who takes notes is perfect. We teach how to take notes here. But this is how many notes he takes. This is how much we really pay attention to what's going on. And so it's not just wham, bam, thank you, Matt, which I do like sometimes. But it's not just that. It's <laughs> we focus on people getting better. And so I read all these notes. Do I read them all? Yeah. Right? And so uh, last night, I mean, literally, no pain, no pain, walk the way you told me, no pain, iced, walk the way you told me, laid down, no pain, woke up, take a pee. Uh, you don't have to take a crap on here, but anyways, um, <laughs> probably left that out. Um, uh, woke up in the morning this morning, slept good, but woke up, had some pain, immediately worked on my posture. Go away. Pain went away. So he's realizing that there is a solution, and the solution is, again, do what I freaking tell him. Oh. Yeah, nice. oh, that was pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, come towards me. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ah! Did you guys hear that? Bullseye. Yeah, so um, this guy's a truck driver. Remember uh, we talked about uh, show me how you sit in your truck? We're gonna do that this week. Okay, so yeah. make sure you bring those pictures, okay? Uh -huh. Because uh, he's doing better here, but we gotta get him back better in his p for profession. So we're gonna show him how to sit in his truck. Even though he doesn't have it here, we're just gonna see what he does, okay? And so um, I can't wait for... Uh, the next video. I mean, he's doing freaking wonderful. So thanks for watching, guys. Hey, Dr. Thayer here. I have a patient holding the camera today, so thank you very much, Ralphie. He's not on camera, so you'll never see this guy. Uh, maybe we'll get a picture at the end when you got the picture together at least, right? But uh, thank you for holding the camera. The the normal way we stand should, be, should our feet be like that? Yeah. Or like, like this? Like that. And so you thought what? I thought it's normally like 
that that's way. That's right. Yeah. And he even did it worse earlier. And so I want, don't, don't move, stay right there. Now if you look guys, I'm pointing to his foot over here. Can you see the pressure of his foot pushing out the outside of the foot right here? You see how the shoe is being torqued? The way he stands is the way he tries to adapt to pain. If you look over this shoe over here, you see it's not as destroyed. destroyed. It's still pushing out, but not as bad as this one. This foot is really destroyed. These shoes are already destroyed. And so I told him to stand out. Like this. Like this, right? Okay. And so you want to stand so that your body, a little closer, a little closer with your feet. You want to stand so you're using the shoes equally. See, it's still pushing out here, but not nearly as much, okay? And so these shoes are pretty much gone. We're going to talk about shoes, getting new shoes later. Um, but if you can stand up now. If you maintain these shoes, this is an important thing. If you maintain these shoes that are, no, 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 no. If you maintain these shoes the way they are right now, and after all the adjustments I made, those are casts of your back in the wrong way, okay? I'm not a big shoe proponent that changes lives and orthotics matter, but again, shitty shoes will undo my work. Does that make sense, guys? And so he's worn these out to create a negative pattern the way he walks. So we're gonna get him new shoes, okay? We're gonna talk about shoes in a few minutes with both these guys, but I recommend the New Balance ones, and I've done it many times with you guys. Uh, firm, good foam. Um, not all foam is the same, by the way. Uh, a lot of crappy foam shoes out there. Stay away from memory foam shoes because they break down really fast, really fast. You guys all like them because they're light, and like, oh my God, they're so great, but they break down instantly. Okay, so uh, any bad habits we magnified in your shoes. Yeah, see how much pain he's in, guys? That's all reflection of not relaxing the shoulders enough. And why am I doing this, guys? I'm not really doing this to stretch him. I don't really care about the muscles as much as I care about putting him in the right position to adjust him. So if there is some tension here, we are stretching the muscles, but we're just trying to get his body in a position that I can adjust it better. Okay. Adjust his shoulders, too, here. Good. Okay, turn to the left a little bit. Turn to the left. There we go. Okay. Okay, nice. That was a good one. That was a good one, yes. <laughs> he did not do his first video. Why didn't we do the very first one? I was saying I'm not going to get that instantly like <laughs> so he didn't think he was gonna get better but he was so much better he jumped in with his mom so you guys are watching this video with his mom how much better is your neck pain dude that's what you came in for 95 percent okay you know. 95 percent yeah uh, carpal tunnel down his left hand oh, I went away feel stronger yeah. now uh, pain down your left leg sciatica went away uh, heart palpitations we haven't talked about that at all oh that changed a lot I mean, like I'm lying down in bed and then when I just breathe you know, normally, I can just feel like the heartbeat is more like really, you know, beating stronger. So you notice the difference there? Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. And what was it like before? I'm curious. I forgot. It was just like, it's beating, but it's kind of low. And then somehow it skips too. Gotcha. But right now it's stronger and it's it really feels cool, like cool. regular. So tell us about constipation. What does that mean? What, is it, what does it mean went away? I forgot how bad you were. What uh, was it? It was like every other day or did you go every day? You just were tight? What was that? What was the problem? Maybe once a week. Yeah. You only go in once a week? No, uh, it happens like once a week. Once a week. week. Oh, yeah. So yeah. how is it better? Just tell, let them know how is the uh, flow going? How's the Hershey stuff going? How's the chocolate going? How's the... <laughs> how's... <laughs> Everything <laughs> going. Just going regular. You're not supposed to be listening to my conversations. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Wow. Tons better than this oh. morning. Oh. Excellent. <sighs> looking, looking solid, eh? Back in the room, please. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, watch the chair behind you, Ralph. So, uh, Ernie, been yeah. wonderful. Thanks for coming down. Uh, yeah. Say hi to your mother for me. Yeah. Um, definitely write us, and uh, don't forget to leave that review on my review sites, right? Mm -hmm. I get a piece of paper. <laughs> Ralph, too. So, uh, anyways, fingers up. Peace. See you guys. He was lifting a, not a really heavy load, but he was moving some M&M boxes. Show us how you lift the boxes. I left the, the, the boxes like this. Like this. How heavy were they, by the way? Let's say like 10 pounds. How did you feel after that? Uh, I hurt my back. Yeah. Really bad, right? Really bad. And how bad was it? Uh, it bothered my sleep. Bothered your sleep. Yeah. And so, how much better did you feel after I saw you? 
pretty good. Pretty good, right? Yeah. And two weeks later, so it's not that my work is perfect, guys. There's still things that get in the way. And this is what I wanted to show you on camera is that um, he did something that aggravated it. Now, I'm also teaching him how to avoid those issues. Now, again, we talked about how to lift better, right? Yeah. Uh, I was so desperate. So when that thing happened, like two days later, it was still so fresh. I was hurting so bad. So I went to a chiropractor in Washington. And man, he just let me lay down there. Mm -hmm. And then I was really thinking, if you can just adjust the neck. Like, <laughs> no, he just put like heat on my back and then just push, 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 push and keep adjusting my hip. I'm like, it's not getting better. And then when he hold my neck, it's not like yours. It was just like, <laughs> and I don't even feel a difference. I went out the door. I'm like, it was a waste. I came in here, but there's no difference. Gotcha. I want to show you guys that uh, you guys all think this is really simple. And this guy seemingly did way more than me. Hot packs, probably a little massage, yeah. maybe one of those <laughs> thumpers, you know, or those whatever they have nowadays. And then adjusted a ton of bones in your body yeah. and adjusted your neck. Yeah. Gotcha. And so, and he came out of there feeling like nothing. You guys are going to watch him get better on camera here. How much pain are you back there? Like two. Two? And where is it? Okay, so now go back like this. How about that? No. 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 Now squat to the ground, please. It's like two or three. No, on gotcha. the right side. Gotcha. Okay, so we're going to adjust his lower neck here. lighter already let's go back in the room it's like you really hit the right spot yeah zero pain yeah go back zero pain and then squat a tiny bit one half yeah one okay. and he feels a difference right away you can see it in his face you see how he walks and he feels lighter and he feels right pressure is different <laughs> yeah good uh, I feel a lot better I learned something new today. And yeah, what? You're short? Yeah. Gotcha. <laughs> I like to keep it simple here, guys. Kiss, keep it simple, stupid. Yeah. yeah. And why is that funny? Not that he's short, that, it, that uh, you know, people look at him and go, ah! No, that's not that. He is short, and so he doesn't fit in his truck seat very well. Yeah. So he thought of ways to change his truck seat to make it more beneficial for his height. True. His limited stature. Yeah. His peewiness. <laughs> So what else? What else has gone on? How you feel in two days? I feel a lot better. I mean, yeah. Like every time you adjust me, my body just goes back to the right. Yeah. Yesterday you said I called it. You called it magic. What does that mean? It's just like the twist of that neck. It's just like right away you you feel instantly the change. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And so again, <clears> we <throat> talked about it yesterday on the other video. We talked about how uh, he went to the chiropractor, popped all his freaking bones in his body and his neck, yeah. and tell us the difference between my adjustment and that adjustment. You said it so. So perfectly, I don't know if we got it yesterday. So about how his touch is versus my touch. Oh, they just hold your 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 neck just like that, so light, and it's like a split of a second. That's it. But right here, he holds your neck in a certain way that when he cracks it, you feel the, you know, you really hit the spot there. I think two a day helps <clears throat> because between adjustments, your body goes back to, you know, getting misaligned. They say. Yeah. Because people always are like, why do I have to do it two a day? Two a day would be just like to hold the adjustment right there. It holds so, it better, right? Yeah. Yeah. You learn faster, guys. And that's what I'm trying to get through to you guys is that you learn faster. And again, it's the best thing I've come up with.
<laughs> Nobody does it like that. <laughs> oh. You do, you do yeah. this on purpose, aren't you? Right? <laughs> hey, this no, is, you're doing it on purpose, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's where the that's where the real adjustment is. Not like <laughs> you twist your neck and you're like, I don't feel any difference. 